this video i shall be discussing about matrimonial remedies other than divorce in india marriage is considered as an eternal bond however in case of certain disputes between the husband and the wife due to some misunderstanding certain matrimonial remedies have been provided in section 9 of hindu marriage act if an husband or a wife deserts his spouse without any reasonable cause the person is free to move to the district court for a decrease of restitution of conjugal right under section 9 of the hindu marriage act certain conditions are laid down for this order from the court first the marriage should be a valid marriage under section 5 of the hindu marriage act second there should be no reasonable cause for the spouse to desert his husband or a wife the court should understand that according to the circumstances of the petition the case is a true case section 10 of the hindu marriage act provides for judicial separation judicial separation is a period where usually of one one year where an husband or the wife are not obligated to fulfill the conjugal rights or their duties towards their spouse include adultery cruelty desertion conversion and soundness of mind leprosy vulnerable diseases remuneration of birth or presumed death these were the conditions provided to both husband and wife there are also some specific conditions provided only to the wife those include by giving by the husband rape sodomy or bestiality by the husband section 11 of the hindu marriage act deals with nullity of marriage void marriages are those marriages which seem to have never existed marriages under section 11 of the hindu marriage act are termed as void ab initio that is marriage which was void from the very beginning certain grounds for void marriages are if the parties were under the prohibited prohibited degree or had a sapinda relationship with each other provided that the custom does not provide so also a ma marriage can be said as a void marriage if the husband or the wife has another living spouse at the time of marriage the section 2 of the hindu marriage act lays down ground for voidable marriages voidable marriages are those marriages which become void at the option of either spouse an order of the court is necessary to declare a marriage as a void marriage grounds for voidable marriages are impotency if either the husband or the wife are found to be impotent if at the time of the marriage either of the spouse was of unsound mind third if the marriage of the spouse was conducted by force or fraud if the wife was found pregnant by another man at the time of a marriage in conclusion although marriage was considered as an eternal bond over a period of time it was realized that husband and the wife can have matrimonial disputes and therefore matrimonial reliefs were introduced if an husband or the wife has a dispute it may not be necessary that he or she takes a divorce they can refer to other matrimonial remedies and can get a separation under them